It's not a great start. They're 14th place. When I saw that, I thought I had to do a double take. Again, they have a game in hand. They got to play that game in hand, and they could pick up, you know, a win and, and get back in the top half. But it's it's a it's a really weird start, and uh, weird to see Man City at the bottom half right now. That's for sure. I don't know what's going on with these these big teams. They they just look like they can be opened up a lot more easily than they have been in the past. They yeah. just look like they, you never hear City conceding five, Liverpool conceding seven. So I don't I don't know if it's anything to do with the fans or uh, or lack of preseason or fitness or I don't know what it is, but it's maybe they're just getting figured out. They know their systems and they're finding ways to expose it. Leicester hitting City on the counter just looked dangerous every time they went forward. Something you've got to think about with Man City is you've got to consider the fact that they've got the Champions League, which they should have done better in last year. Shocking exit, really. And the Premier League, where they feel like they should have done better. They've got a lot of points to prove this year. And again, it comes. they've got a lot of depth, but over how much? They won a lot of the Cups last year, but at the end of the day, they won the Premier League, they won the Champions League. Those are what means most to them. So it's yeah. about how they their, their squad. Uh, luckily, they do have a lot of depth, but it's a cause for concern.